Most women love to shop, but did you know that female shoppers get charged more at the register than men? New York City's Department of Consumer Affairs recently did a study that revealed across all the industries that were surveyed, women paid more 42% of the time for identical or similar products than those marketed to men. We looked at products that women would buy from the youngest age all the way up to seniors. And what this can mean for women over the course of an average lifetime is literally thousands of dollars that women are paying for these products more than men. We decided to see for ourselves. Going to pharmacies and searching the internet. Yes, men's products seem to cost less. Hmm, same product, same weight, same size, hmm, price. This study showed that for general toys, women paid 11% more. Check out these boys versus girls shark helmets. They look almost the same, except the one for girls cost $27.99 versus $14.99 for boys. These t-shirts look almost identical, except in price. Girls pay a dollar more. Shampoo and conditioner, a whopping 48% more. Well, at least these bladder guards are priced the same. But wait. There's a catch. Look closely and you'll see the men's comes with 52 pads, but the women's with only 39. These are issues of national concern. These are not concerns that are indigenous only to New York City because many of the products we sampled were national chains. It costs more for a woman? Mm -hmm. Wow. That's terrible, especially when women don't make as much. Argue at the register. You're going to argue at the register? Yeah, at the register. Yeah, what yeah. are you going to say? Don't charge me more for don't charge you more when female. just because I'm a woman. As a woman, you know, we're used to that stuff. Like, honestly, at this point, it's like, what can you do already? We sent letters to the CEOs of every manufacturer and retailer of the 800 products that we sampled to urge them to change this practice. Did they respond? No, they have not. Not even one CEO? No one? They did not. Did they respond? No, they did not. Dina Gosofsky, CNBC Business News. Hey YouTube fans, I'm Landon Downey from CNBC. Thanks so much for checking out our channel. Here you'll find videos packed with all the info that you need to be smarter about your finances. Be sure and subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me to see CNBC's original series, Young Money, Tech Bet, Kramer's Mad Money, and all the latest from CNBC.